Hey, this is Uriel Kane, your personal fitness coach. I'm sitting on a stability ball. So a lot of people ask me, how do I choose a stability ball? Well, very simply, if you're sitting on it, your thighs should be parallel to the floor. This ball is a little bit soft, but for me it's okay. So again, if you're up here on the ball, it's too big. If you're way down low, it's too small. Why I'm telling you this is because I'm going to take you through three awesome exercises for your core that revolve around the stability ball. Now these are fairly challenging, so if you're a novice, you may want to build up to these. If you're more advanced and you really want to put your limits, try these out. You're going to feel an amazing workout in just a few minutes. So the first one we're going to do, I don't even know the name, but I know it's effective. So here's how it works. You're in a push-up position. Both feet are on the ball. One leg is stabilizing, the other one's working. So I'm going to start with my right leg, pushing up towards the ceiling, I drive it through and to the side. Back, through, out to the side. Back, through, out to the side. You can do as many as you want on that one side, and we're going to switch. So it's up, through, and in. Up, through, and in. Try about six or eight of those on each side, then move on to the next one. Next exercise we're doing is kind of a scissor type motion with the ball between your legs. So you can place the hands just beneath the bump of support. Legs are off the floor, okay? You can play with the angle here. You can come up, you can come down. Starting here at nine and three with the feet. Then you're going to 12 and six. 12 and six. 12 and six. Play with the angle, bring them up a little higher. Come back, hold, adjust the feet if you need to. Again, rotate and rotate. Give that about 30 seconds. And you're gonna feel this, it'll burn in the core. Last exercise is called a pike. I'm gonna show you a couple variations here. So again, push up position. Eat her on the ball. The key here is that the ankles stay strong and the bum does not drop down. So the lower back is up here, core is tight. We're drawing the bum towards the ceiling and bringing the ball in. So it's here, up, and down. It's up, and down. Notice how my ankles are not moving at all. It's there, if you want to make this more challenging, bring one foot off the ball. So it's up, and up. Down, up, and up. Or, we're here, up, drive it through, up, drive it through, and back. So, if you're in any sports, you need more core strength, or if you just want a stronger core, give those exercises a shot. If you have a stability ball, you gotta use it. Three awesome exercises to try. This is Uriel Kame, stay tuned for the next workout.